Fire Rush is about the quest of a woman within the male dominated dub reggae underworld as she uses the power of the music to find places of safety for her mind and body. It explores the contradictions of reggae dance halls, which were sites of safety for migrant communities, but also sites of danger for the women. The book is structured into three parts. Part one focuses on the underground world inhabited by the migrant Caribbean community of England in the 1970s. Part two is set within the urban landscape of Bristol and a so-called safe house. And part three goes to the magical cockpit country cast landscape of Jamaica, an area of cultural and environmental significance, home to revolutionaries. A liminal world, an audiotopia, is another place that runs through all the landscapes. The story takes place in the 1970s and 1980s as Margaret Thatcher comes into power with the ensuing strikes and riots. And the history of the Atlantic slave trade also seeps into the narrative, rupturing the timeline as the past bears down on some of the characters. Yame is based on me. The book is autobiographical in parts and through Yame, I'm exploring past experiences, trying to gain deeper understanding of the relationships I had within my family, with people I lost and dysfunctional relationships with, with men that ended in violence. However, there are aspects of Assassin in me as well. And in many of the characters, I'm trying to show nuance, light, dark, and the colors in between. Most people don't know that the that, that sound revolution subculture existed because it took place underground at night a very long time ago. I wanted to bring that world back to life using memory and imagination. I also wanted to platform a woman's perspective because there are not many books about this culture and certainly none that platform a woman's perspective.